guys, it's Melissa. In this video, I'm going to give you a quick tip on how to export just the portion of your work area that you want to and not the entire uh, cutting mat. This is helpful for a role inversal work so that you don't get all of this excess over here. So um, we have already changed the contour cut line here to be the role inversal works contour cut line. If you're not sure how to do that, I have another video on that. Um, but when you are ready to export this as a PDF, you can just go up to, um, well, first of all, you want to make sure that you have your layers selected. So we're going to select, and then we will just make sure that everything is selected. Okay, so we need all of this. So we've got layers, we've got the curves and paths. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go uh, to File and Export. Now, when we export as a PDF, we get this option here for area. So if you keep it on the default is going to default to whole document, which is all of this whole area, um, which is going to then create a situation in VersaWorks where you're going to need to clip. All right. So we don't want to do that. We just want to, uh, so we only want to export the selection. All right. The only things that are selected are what we want to export. And so once we change that to selection area and click export, um, we will, um, get just that to export. So let's look at the difference here. I've actually just downloaded this so I can show you the differences here. So I'm gonna zoom in a little bit if I can. So this is where the file that I exported just the area. This is a previous version that I exported and I, and I left it as the default where I have the whole uh, PDF. So you can see here, how this now has all this excess area over there, which is what we don't want. So if you're trying to just minimize the work that you need to do in VersaWorks, this is a really good way to do that.